Hello, UA Path experts. In this video, we will see about the a new project called Remote Desktop. So, navigate to the Boss DNA under the Potato package, so you can see the uh, a remote desktop. So, what it means? There is a one employee continuously has to every day the, the the task is like a so he he has a number of server details like the IP address and username and password. So he has to navigate to the each and every system, okay, uh, through the remote desktop by passing, by supplying the, this IP address, username, and password. So they have to check whether the scheduler is working or not. There is a scheduler icon is there in the desktop. In the scheduler icon, it, he has to double click on the scheduler icon and it will just open the scheduler win, uh, application. He has to check whether the schedule is up, ran, ran today's date or not. If it's not ran, then he has to uh, change the date and start the run the job. Okay, he has to run the job manually. Okay, so but now we are going to automate this kind of work. So he's almost taking the uh, more than a, a, a half day uh, every day, every day, every day he has to check. This is a regular activity. Okay. So we have to, so what, what I'm saying is you have to create a, a robot to do this kind of work. The robot will uh, run every day in the morning uh, or, or the evening, you can say this evenings. If it is not ran, actually it is not ran for any computer, remote desktop. So the robot has to pick each and every, uh, basically the robot has to pick each and every record from here, record from here and check whether the schedule is ran from today or not. Okay, so it has to pick the today's date in the system and check the, if it's not there, then it has to run. Okay, so let, let us take a one by one. So, so this is like, a, so it has to loop each and every record. Just copy, I'm pasting here and uh, here copy paste. And if you just click on this one, so it will just give the a encrypted password. Okay, this is an encrypted password. It's not an actual password, so you have to convert this into the um, uh, plain text. Okay, so how can you do? So basically, a, a, a UA path uh, a package will support UA path. Uh, what is it here? So crypto, crypto. Okay. Cryptography. Just type the cryptography. You can see the an activity called UiPath.cryptography. Dot activities. Okay, so it is a uh, built by the UiPath. Uh, this package. So where you can encrypt, uh, where you can decrypt the text. So actually, so when once you click on the a copy button in this so copy button is suppose if I click the second one. So this is a second one pass. Okay. So basically the third one. So the third one password, but so we were not try and typing the same password into the a window password window. So you have to encrypt that, uh, or it is encrypted password. So you have to decrypt that. So how can you decrypt? So just type the decrypt, uh, decrypt text, and uh, here so use the same uh, by default algorithm, A A S and uh, G C M. And then, so there is a, some decryption keys there here. Here, so we provided in the bots DNA itself. Just use this key here for the UA path users. <clears throat> and I'm and, and, and just pasting the first one. Okay, first one. Okay, so basically everything has to be done by the a robot only. Okay, so I'm just showing you what is the requirement. So it has to take this one. The once. You, See, it's not reading the text. So it is a once you click on the this one, so it will save or set the clipboard, okay, into your system. So you have to read the data from the clipboard, okay. So you can you can use the clipboard activities. So you have a multiple clipboard activities, and now the output will be the decrypted the plain text, okay, output. So I'm just pasting log message output. So that we can use that output into to log into that particular first server. Go to here, and this is out the password. The password like this. This copy and go to the password session paste here, and click on the continue. So once you click on the connect, so it will just uh, log into that particular server. 
So it's loading the server, so the robot has to wait. So up to the desktop is up here. So now the desktop is up here. So what you have to do, so the robot has to click on this icon. So double click, not click, double click. So once you double click on this icon, so here there is a last run date is there. So the last run date is the, 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 the five, right? But actually, so I'm in sixth, right? I'm in sixth. Now the current date. So what the robot has to do, robot has to change this date to six and click on the run. If it is already six, no need to run again the job. Okay. So click on the run. It will the robot is running successfully, right? So just close the window and you can sign off. Okay. So that is a task. So every system it has to log into the uh, login and check, double click on the um, scheduler. Check whether the uh, job ran for today or not. If it's a today, no need to do anything. So just close the uh, that particular window and click on the sign off. Okay. Just again go to the uh, next session. So I'm just uh, I, I will show the only uh, two. So you can try for the others. Here, copy. If I just take this one, copy to the clipboard. That is a uh, this one, right? So I'm just pasting here itself. Okay. To decrypt the text. Now we'll see what is the actual password for that. The password is this one, okay. Go here, click on this and just paste, click on connect. Uh, we're logging into the next server. So okay, the server, each server has a desktop. The desktop contains the icon called scheduler. So the robot has to Again, the weight has up to the desktop is up here. So just, just double click, it's not click, double click on the scheduler and see the second server, it ran. The schedules are already ran. So no need to uh, do any work. Okay, so just simply, because see six of six, if I'm just copy and paste into here so that you can understand six, okay. And my um, my current date is also six. Okay, no need to run. Just close the window and go to the sign off. Go for the next truck <coughs> system. Okay, uh, this is a task. And by doing this task, you can interact with the clipboard. We can interact with the cyber uh, cryptography to to encrypt and decrypt the passwords and log into the servers. Okay, so there is uh, some logic to check, implement. So happy learning. So please uh, practice this by using the. Um, maybe the RE framework or any, any logical, just logic build, okay? Thank you very much for watching. So, um, so another projects also will come into the potato project, potato package. Thank you very much, bye-bye.